Hello guys, it's Mr. Sim here for another episode in our Minecraft adventure. Today we are going to be looking at building a church. Um, this is going to be a fairly large building, so uh, most of the village can gather here, um, make a prayer, you know, what everyone does in a church. There's not really much to do, but it's a very large building normally. So. I'm going to keep the theme with the rest of the village, which is um, sandstone blocks. Um, I, I use a variety of the smooth sandstone, the normal sandstone, and the chisel sandstone. I do like the chisel sandstone. Um, it's quite a nice effect. Um, as, as you can see, I start by laying, laying the foundations of the building. Um, I do change my mind a little bit. You probably don't see it as it does take quite a long time to make my mind up what I want the building to look like um, but once I do um, I start um, raising the building as you can see here um, I think this building will overlook most of the village um, it's going to it's rather central or rather it's going to be close to all the other buildings of course um, it's going to be tall enough to have large glass pane windows um, and for this episode you'll see me build up this church and at first you'll be you probably wonder why it's the shape it is um, or it might not look right but I give it a good go and the end result I am pleased with um, it is a nice looking building at the end um, in the next episode just to give you a little heads up I think I'll be building a small like port area um, at the start of the video you saw a little sort of indent in the land in the sand um, where the water is and I think that's where I'm going to build it, it's sort of right close to the, the sort of the bridge, the gap in the wall um, and obviously if, if boats are coming in and boats are coming out they're going to need someone to put the boats and to make the village look more complete, um, yeah I'll, I'll build a little uh, docks, a docking area, I think I'll give that a good go as well. So as you can see here I'm just building sort of the area where the head of the church will stand and, and pray pray to people and sing and whatever the hell they do in a church um, so yeah I'm just building it up now it's, it's, as I said it's going to be quite a high bit um, high building um, however this bit is going to be more like a tower and it's going to look over the rest and the roof's going to on the front bit the long sort of uh, long rectangle part of the building will have a roof and it will connect to the tower and it will look church like it's obviously going to be weird but as I said the end result is quite nice you, you really got to sort of see the end result um, before you, you know before you can judge um, it is a weird shape um, I was going to go for a, a proper circle obviously um, the dimensions were wrong so I made this shape and as I said I'm happy with it so, um, last episode we took a break, um, you know, first episode with commentary, it is hard actually, <laughs> didn't realise how hard it was to, to talk and comment, um, on your video for a set amount of time, without taking long periods like breaks, you know, um, I find it easier with live commentary because, as I've done, I've done two episodes with, um, my cousin Ryan, Miss, um, Milaj, we done a FIFA versus series. We started that um, Monday, um, and that, and that went pretty well actually. We done a dual commentary. Um, it, it, um, the episodes, first one was about ten minutes, and the set, and then we done live commentary with the second. So it was more free flowing. Um, we got well, we could say you know how we felt in the moment rather than sort of just go over it, um, sort of like I'm doing now. Um, yeah, it, it was good. Um, if you're, you know, subscribers, anyone who's watched the video, want to check that out. Um, that's on a, a playlist, FIFA vs series, I believe it's called. Um, yeah, so coming back to the building, uh, as you can see, the roof is basically done now. Um, and the building, then I'll raise the tower up, and um, it, it, it looks alright actually. Um, Although the roof looks very large, I must I must admit. Um, but I'm not, as I said, I'm not going to complain. The building 
it's a build and at the end of the day I spent quite a long time on this actually um, I was gonna hope to get the docks with this in this episode but despite this is trimmed down by a heck of a lot um, it's still quite a long video and to be honest I don't really wanna be uploading like half hour long videos just yet I think putting it into like 10 minute to 15 minute long episodes is works quite well um, it's a lot less um, a lot easier for me as well um, I can cope with it more um, the editing takes a while because um, obviously it's you got to try and make it look a bit smooth you don't want to just sort of cutting out whilst you're doing something you know it's got to be free flowing like the commentary really so um, I'm just lighting up the area and as you see I haven't done the floor yet um, I skip that so later on I'm not too sure when you'll see the floor just suddenly change and I think I use stone bricks for that stone yeah that is yeah stone bricks and um, it just breaks out the the sand colours you know the sandstone and the sand you know breaks it out makes it look a bit better more um, more of an expensive building and um, yeah so as you see here I now cut out like slots for the windows um, this will be sort of a very large window, two two blocks wide, and then the rest are normally uh, one block wide. But um, yeah, as you can see here, there's bloody creepers everywhere. Fucking creepers everywhere. Spy my creative, whip my sword out, and um, kill them before they explode. I've already spent a while flattening out the land and filling in gaps um, so I can build on it. I didn't really want to have a nice crater in my land because stupid creepers want to spawn there and I really really don't want to um, so yeah as I said um, little heads up next episode we can do the docks so I can move on to finishing off the main gate the entrance the stairs down and how it's going to look uh, build some more like um, more market stalls I mean in the other episodes when I started building obviously I've built market stalls um, we sort of like the main town hall in the like the inner bit of the village, sort of the bit that's connected to my main house, the large sort of castle house. Um, but yeah, if, if I replicate some of them, bring them over here, then that, that can be more of like an upstate market, like an expensive place to buy expensive um, ingredients and tools and whatnot. Um, I can build some more, more small houses, I can build, you know, there's so much I can do. I know I haven't got a massive amount of space left, but I've got enough to fit in pretty much everything I've said there. Um, once we've done that, we can go explore some more, or if you if you think I should, I, um, I'll i be more than happy to expand the village even more. I can, I'll be more than happy to take out a bit of the wall, make sort of like a, a passageway, going into another, like a large bit. Um, you know, it's all ideas at the moment. Start off the episodes and the series not too long ago as a channel. We've been operating for what, a week, two weeks now. Um, got a lot of videos out actually. Um, we're hitting, we nearly hit 20 videos already. Um, I'm, I'm quite pleased with our progress. Um, obviously, we're not very popular at the moment. Um, we're trying to advertise a little bit we're not trying to be so like like a lot of people they you know do um, sub subs and stuff like that we're not we're not advertising like that we're just sort of slowly um, sort of commenting on a couple of videos we haven't really done much we have got a sort of steady flow of viewers and we've hit 10 subscribers there's not a lot um, but we're happy with that actually um, for a week or two it's gone well um, hopefully the videos kick off and they get a bit more views I've noticed um, obviously I've used um, Esvid um, to record and edit um, it's a free bit of software um, at the moment it's working really well um, I quite I quite enjoy it it's really easy to use it's um, a nice bit of software but um, I did use Arcsoft Showbiz 5 um, uh, I, it was a lot more complicated, but I managed to edit it, edit the video clip in real great detail. Um, but the only problem was, well, 
Actually, no, that wasn't a problem. No, sorry, I'll take that back. That wasn't a problem. Um, it's just I think this is a lot more user friendly. So, yeah, throughout the series, you probably see me use a few bits of software. Um, and as you can see, on the church here, I built built on the way to the the top. And this is going to be sort of like a the cover. So you, you know, if it's raining, you're not going to get wet if you go to the top. And then there's going to be ladders either side. You can see the two hole entries. And on top, like any church, there's going to be a bell. So the easiest way to make a bell is obviously out of gold blocks. Um, I didn't realise here, but I messed up the dimensions. I made this bit a bit too long. Oh, pardon me. So um, when I'm actually creating the bell, <laughs> I mess it up and it doesn't look right. It looks too wide and too chunky. Um, as you can see, it's way too wide. It needs to be two by two by two, or whatever the dimensions are. Um, so I have a second go. Um, no, actually, sorry. Yeah, I do have a second go, but I finally realised that the dimensions are wrong. So I correct them. Easily done, and easily an easy mistake to make. To be honest, I have done it. As I said last episode, plenty of other times I've made mistakes but for you guys I'm gonna make this try and look, make this look perfect. Um, and there you go that is one bell tower. Just put a little roof on that I think. Um, add some glowstone give it a little bit of a visual effect. And put the roof on and that is the church done on the the, the structure side. Um, then after the roof we move on to the inside of the church. Um, as I said earlier on, the floor took a little while because obviously I had to dig out all the sand. And despite on creative, it does take a while, so um, I think here I had some railings or an extra block just to make it so when you're walking around, you can't just walk off the top of the building, you know, you'd just die. <laughs> uh, it's not very good, but you know, uh, as I said, the end look, it looks really good, I think. Um, so, as I said, stone bricks, um, I really like this texture actually, um, this texture pack has been my favourite, I used a, I did use um, <coughs> another texture pack and I honestly cannot remember the name of it, um, I've still got the texture pack installed so I can easily switch but I really like this texture pack, it's really, really nice and smooth and the textures and certain things are really awesome. Um, despite diamonds and whatnot, uh, hexagons and stuff, but I actually think it looks better um, than the original, and, and some textures are better than the original. Um, so I'm just finishing off the seating area, and as you can see here, um, just change a little bit for, the, for where the head of the church stands and preaches. And there you go, that is one church done. So, guys, thank you for watching. And I'll see you in episode 12.